Macmillan Cancer Support has big aspirations for improving the lives of people living with cancer. There are currently 2.5 million people living with cancer in the UK and this number is expected to reach 4 million by 2030. Each of these people needs care and support to help them take back control of their lives. Macmillan uses authoritative and reliable data to better understand what people need throughout their cancer journey and beyond. To do this, we work in a range of ways to understand the needs of people living with cancer and their expectations of the health and social care system. The more we know, the more we understand. And this helps us support the system to better meet people's needs. Experts at Macmillan do this by using and producing data analysis, such as Roots from Diagnosis, a powerful approach that analyzes and maps routine health data from multiple sources. Roots from Diagnosis helps us to understand how factors such as health, age, or the type of treatment they received affects the outcome of a person's cancer journey. This work has already been used to design new care pathways in different parts of the UK. Another example of our work is the Local Cancer Intelligence Tool, which brings together local data on the needs and priorities of people with cancer. This evidence helps local commissioners develop better cancer services in their area. We've also established new research programmes, such as the CREW study, CRU stands for Colorectal Wellbeing. It's a study of recovery following colorectal surgery. It is the first large-scale longitudinal study asking the same group of people with colorectal cancer about various aspects of their lives before treatment begins and at regular intervals following their surgery. The strong evidence shows health and social care professionals how people are impacted by colorectal cancer and its treatment. This helps us help them to regain control of their lives. Our evidence identifies where and how change is needed and it helps us support and work with the help and social care system to respond to the needs of people with cancer. But there is still more work to be done. We need to make sure that with the necessary safeguards in place, the right information is being collected from people with cancer and that it's shared and used across the system to improve people's lives. One of the ways we will meet our aspirations with data will be by working with the best people, best organisations and best technology to ensure that the most robust and insightful data informs the development of services and drives change across multiple audiences. This will help to improve the lives of the growing number of people living with cancer and make sure that no one faces cancer alone.